Hey Evil Dead fans, if you've been watching these videos, you'll know that I'm working on the Book of the Dead. Now, if you notice, I've already put on the uh, um, squares of the toilet paper rolls, or uh, squares from a toilet paper roll, and I've layered it on thicker different spots where I like it. And you can see right there that curl I told you about. And like I said in the past video, we're going to fix that. But it's looking really good, and what that layering does, it gives it a nice looking like skid and kind of ripply look and really just layers it on now what i'm going to do right now is show you the next step once that's dry now when you have high points hold on ah high excuse me high points like you want to do like something that looks a little thinner like edges like this and like this, that's when you have to use Gorilla Glue. Now Gorilla Glue phones, and you're gonna have to babysit this when you do it. And you don't want to use a lot. So if you want a good high point, and if you want to get like your eyebrows thicker with a good base, definitely go with the toilet paper first, and then go with the Gorilla Glue. Because Gorilla Glue is very touchy. You don't want to use too much. Now, if you use too much, it's gonna be it's just dangerous. Because when it starts to foam and you just don't pay attention to it, it really just 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 takes its own form. And there's nothing much you can do. So you really have to babysit this. Let's put a little more around this lip here. Not much, you don't want to go super thick with it. It does work with moisture, so if you've been going step by step, see how it's thick right there? I need to get rid of some of that, it's way too much. Yeah, a little thick right there too. Yeah, if, if you let it get away from you, it can really ruin it, ruin the look, because it, it turns into basically concrete when it's done. We were just trying to get a nice subtle lip to it. When it starts to foam, then you can really work with it, because when it starts to foam, you can start um, depressing the foam and, and pushing it in and forming it. But when it's in a liquid form here, shouldn't do this with your hands you, you should really use gloves because gorilla glue really likes to stick to your hands for a long ass time and i really honestly hate having it on my hands now let's say you want some just dimples here and there just stick a little bit here and there kind of warty look Now on the inside of the cover, I usually just use Gorilla Glue when I do the textures other than the toilet paper and glue, just an initial, um, on the initial um, form of it. Because there's really no reason to, uh, to put a lot of uh, lines with the toilet paper, the roll up toilet paper on the inside. It's kind of up to you if you want to do that, but for me, I would rather not. It's a lot of extra work that you really don't need to do. And when it, this stuff, when it foams, it foams. It goes. So you definitely want to babysit it. So that's what we're looking at right now. And, uh, yeah. I definitely want it super thick right here and right here. This spot, I really should be using gloves, but I'm... Not that's why I always wear like a dirty coat. I have a work coat to where I can white paint, glue, whatever on, and it just I can just wipe it on my shirt versus trying to find a rag somewhere. Cause that that's just way harder to do. But really, that's it. I mean, it's at, for this step. That's really all it is. Um, let me uh. 
think of another question. Let me come up with an easy question for you guys for uh, the uh, giveaway for this book when it's done. Here's the next question. In the original Evil Dead, who were the two fishermen standing by the bridge at the beginning of the movie that Bruce Campbell and his friends drove by that uh, waved to him? That's the next question. Now, you got to remember, if somebody's answered these questions correctly, that's okay. You can still answer it. It still puts you in the drawing for it. So don't, don't be, uh, you know, thinking, well, they got it right. They're going to win it. Well, if you can answer it right and it's the same answer and it is correct, you will be in the running as well. So just to let you guys know that. So until next time, you guys have a great day. Bye.